Oh, thank God they fixed it. I never have to worry about this again, huh? Fuck my life. Fucking, fucking, fucking kill me. I told y'all they were gonna fucking fix the leak. I told y'all. They're never going to fix the leak. They will keep putting up patches to cover the holes. And then what's gonna happen? The water fills up and creates new holes. Oh, but as long as they're not doing an inspection while there's a shower going on upstairs, I get to continue living this way. Hooray! Be grateful, be happy, be thankful to be living someplace where the upstairs bathroom rains down on you. Be grateful, bitch, be grateful. Fucking kill me, please. Isn't this just lovely? Don't you all wish you could wake up to this at 7 o'clock in the morning every day? Isn't this just, just the best? I told y'all they weren't going to fix that leak. <laughs> Literally, ever. They didn't fix it the first time. That's why it started leaking again through. They, they, they are never... <laughs> And then people say, well, why can't you just be grateful that you have a roof over your head? It's not a roof. I can't go to the bathroom right now. Because if I do, I will be cascaded with hot water from the upstairs shower. That's not having a roof. That's the opposite of having a roof over your head. I'm literally at the moment... The bathroom is full of the upstairs shower water. How can anybody defend this as being a helm? I was sleeping in a truck and not getting rained on every time somebody else took a shower. I've slept in tents that I was able to keep dry when it was actually raining. But this is supposed to be better because it's a roof. Because it's a home. <laughs> Woohoo. I was literally doing better keeping myself sanitary and healthy living on the streets. And nobody even understands that. This is bullshit, and they're not going to fix it. They're just going to let them, the drywall continue breaking through. They're just going to let the water continue piling up and molding out my ceiling until it kills me. The mold is going to kill me, and then what are they going to do? They're going to clean the place out and move somebody else in here to live and die in the mold. And there is nothing I can do. I can't fix the leak myself. Calling the landlord obviously isn't going to do anything because they were just here yesterday and they did not fix the leak. I told them, please fix the leak. Don't just patch the ceiling. I literally told them, don't just patch the ceiling. You have to fix the leak because you patched the ceiling last time and it was still leaking. You have to fix the leak. They don't care. They're not going to. They will put up enough bandages to pass the inspection next week and that's all they're going to do. I get an entire year of living with my bathroom like that. But, but but they pass inspections, so I get a year of living here. 